All right. We made it to the first Friday of distance learning. Excellent. Um, for today, not a whole lot to do, but still a lot of important things to do here. Uh, one, we're going to go over kind of a learning goal and scale for this first big uh, distance learning lab we're going to do. Go over some of the parts and then do a quick check for understanding. Uh, learning goal and scale, it's like you see in all classes, just that four, three, two, one kind of scale. Again, our goal is to get you to 3.0 or higher, is can you do these tasks? That's the key, all right? Um, 2.0 is to some learning of definitions. 1.0 is, um, I suppose, you can uh, take what you learned from previous tasks and apply it. But can you get to 3.0? That's our goal for that one. 3.0 is key. Uh, the lab components sheet, it's kind of like the uh, what are robots used for. It's a project lead the way worksheet. So read, 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 read. Uh, the parts we're going to be using for this first few builds are here. Uh, we use things called axle collars, which is kind of like a, a dog collar. It kind of just keeps things, uh, keeps a dog on a leash, kind of, sort of. This little metal wheel locks onto axles, and then they'll lock a wheel or a sprocket or a gear onto an axle. Um, the axles we use here, they're square. Square axles, kind of odd, but they're square axles. Uh, bushings, think of them like a, a spacer or a, uh, a bearing that's going to make the axle, when slid through it, kind of spin more freely, more smoothly. We use bolts to bolt things together with our fasteners. These teeth are critical. The teeth need to be pointed towards the plates you're attaching. They'll bite in and kind of hold things secure. And little spacer bars. Um, structure parts, too many to show on the fixtures we didn't. Uh, some of the gears we're going to use based on the number of teeth, like a 12 tooth, 36 tooth, and so on and so forth. We're learning about what a driver gear is, what a driven gear is, some gear ratios, all that and more throughout the build. And this is going to be our first build for Monday. We're going to build the testing plate on Monday. So today our task is just to kind of um, read through this read through this and then do our quick check for understanding and that'll make friday friday questions get up top somewhere push the little send me an email button and i'll take care of those